Hey what's up guys welcome to my new video and in this video we will see what character map transformations are. So these are basically used for formatting of columns based on user selection. So there are couple of things which we can do like we can uh, change the uppercase letters to lowercase letters and vice versa and there are many options available for uh, Chinese characters like full width, half width and uh, so on. So let us see what it is. So for that we need a source, so OLEDB source. Then we need a destination, so let us keep it same. And we need character map. Alright, so let us configure this. Okay select the table so the table is employee details all right now it will go to character map now inside this we will change the name from uppercase to lowercase oh sorry lowercase to uppercase all right these are actually used to keep a standard across your uh, across your data so if you want to keep everything in uppercase letters, then you can use this uh, character map. So press OK. Then it will go to this OLEDB connection destination. Now let us configure this. Everything is same, just the name of the table is different. Okay, let us see the map mapping. So we will use this instead of this. We will use copy of name. Alright. Now let us execute this. So before that I will show you what is there inside employee details. Alright. So we have these four entries. Alright. Let us execute this. Oh, so it has succeeded. All right. Let us see what is there inside our new table. All right. So it is same, I guess. Yes. There we go. So you can see it has converted this lowercase names into uppercase. Right. Let us do the same thing and convert this into lowercase letters. And we will pass those to our this table. This table only. Alright. Or we can do it the other way. We can take the data from capital table we'll put and we will put it into a small case table right just we need to change this all right now let us run this so it has succeeded now there should should be two entries okay there should be two entries inside this table There we go, you can see there are two entries. So this is the original data, this fourth row and the rest data is being copied from the capital employee data caps table, details cap table. So that's it. There are uh, many more operations which you can do, but these are of no use for us because these are Japanese characters. So if you are using them, display the Japanese characters then you can make use of them and Chinese characters as well so that's it thanks for watching guys and if you got something from this video do click on the like button do subscribe share this video and comment if you want thank you